Today we try the other other white meat. Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. Okay, today we are going to be eating a burger made out of eel. Huh. But first, we are honored that we have been nominated with a streamy show of the year award. Well, we didn't, we didn't receive the award. We received the- We've been nominated with it. Nomination. <laughs> and, and we've been nominated with it. And here's the thing, in order for us to win show of the year, yes. um, we would need you to vote. Mm. And not just vote once, but vote a, a lot. lot, multiple times a day, up until basically the award show. Right. Um, it's 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 a popularity contest where we can mobilize you to help us win. So what we want to ask you to do is not vote for us. Whoa, Link, um, that's radical. No, it, but we've discussed this, right? Yeah, we this have. Not a surprise. I'm acting surprised. Uh, we don't want you I'm a to good vote actor. for us for our streamy show of the year. What we want you to do is take all that, first of all, thank you for those of you who have done this in the past, and you guys have mobilized yourselves, and right. so many people have voted, and you spent so much personal time. Right, a, lo a lot of effort has been spent in past years. And so what we want you to do is to take all that effort that you would be putting into voting for us, and tweeting, and sharing, and doing all that stuff, and instead, putting it into saving the internet. Yes, we want you to help with the continuance of net neutrality. Now, mm -hmm. you probably heard multiple internet creators talk about net neutrality. Uh, you can research this more in the, uh, at the website we're gonna send you to, but just stated simply, it's basically the way the internet works right now and the way we would like it to continue to work is that internet service providers are not allowed to block or discriminate against content on those networks that they provide. And we want things to stay that way because we we benefit from that greatly, right? And coincidentally, it helps to ensure the creation of shows like Good Mythical Morning that then can mm -hmm. one day potentially win Show of the Year at the streamy. So we want you to go to savetheinternet.com where you can find out more information about what net neutrality is and also more specifically and how it relates to what, which, what we want you to do, you can take action. You can click on take action and there are multiple ways and they're updating it regularly, multiple ways for you to take action. Take that time and that effort that you would put behind uh, helping our show win Show of the Year and instead help save the internet. So save the internet. Dot com. Thank you for being your mythical best. And supporting entertainment for all of us in the future. Yes. The future entertainers. Okay, uh, Shake Shack has become Snake Shack. Mm. Uh, this is the news uh, for this Friday and Saturday only yeah. at the Madison Park location in New York. They are releasing a special edition eel burger. Mm. Move over, filet of fish. Yummy. This is, yeah, this is, this is, this is the big... Um, buzzworthy thing that they're doing. Not a sponsor, but they do make a great burger. Um, uh, but will the they make a great eel burger? Uh, I don't know, is this a good idea? Well, the way we're gonna find out uh, whether or not it's a good idea is we're going to try it today. How are we gonna do that? We're not in New York, it's not mm -mm. Friday yet. Mm -mm. Uh, what we have done is we have taken everything we know about the eel burger that Shake Shack will be releasing. Uh, and here's what we do know about it. It's created by British chef Fergus Henderson. Love him. Uh, of course, it features real eel, real eel meat. Don't love it. Um, topped with bacon, pickled red onions, mm. creme fraiche, fresh horseradish, and watercress. Watercress. Uh, and it's going for a $9.99 is what they're gonna sell it for. They've done this before. They had that shrimp burger, huge hit. Now that like, one sounds good. They only made a thousand of them. Hu oh, longest wow. line they've ever had at Shake Shack. We don't wanna go wait in the line. So we've created. Or, or travel across the country and then wait in a line. This is no joke, ladies and gentlemen. This oh, isn't some man. ugly Rhett and Link thing that because we don't know how to cook. No, we have taken the collective powers of our crew and they have wow. created an eel burger that actually looks legit. It looks like bacon on top. It is bacon on top <laughs> because I just said it was topped with bacon. I heard that. You weren't listening. You were focusing on Ric Flair. What's that right there? Uh, that's He's a, doing better now. Uh, yeah. Shout out to Ric Flair. He's out of the hospital. Um, my well wishes go out to him. Woo! <laughs> so I'm gonna cut. I don't know if I should cut. You want? Do you want to cut on the indent, or do you want to cut perpendicular to the indent? Well, the indent's there for a reason. But yeah, let's just use it because that way we each get a half a slice. Of Knife bacon. in the ditch. <laughs> Now, I did touch both sides of the burger, but you're my buddy. <laughs> That's fine. Uh, here, let's, 
Let's open her up. Look at that, kids. Mm. Now there's tomato under there. Oh, come on, man. Don't be that guy. No, there's no, it's not tomato anyway. It's pickled red onion. Oh, good. Mm. Your day just got better. Okay, so Okay, I'm now again, this. no no affiliation with Shake Shack. We did not call Shake Shack. Shake Shack has not approved this. For all I know, this is better than what they're going to be selling. Now the patty has what? Quinoa? In it? Uh I think it has uh it has some uh some other ingredients to kind of round it out. Uh to patify it. To uh it, they call it a binding agent, Link. Yes, they do. Hmm? <laughs> Let's put it back together for a Kiss moment. Kiss it. And frisk it. Oh. Oh, there's no weapons here. Oh, you've already, you've already, he's already eaten it. Hmm. That is really good. That is, you guys, you guys are on another level now. Hmm. <laughs> really good. I mean, it's not a, it's not like a cheeseburger. I, I mean, I, but well, for what it is, I mean, I can't. Can you taste? I can't taste eel. I, I think cannot, that's a victory. Yeah, I, I do not. not taste, I don't taste any eel. Oh, I'm not. Still, I'm still really nervous to swallow it. But <laughs> hold on. yeah, hold on. You just because I know you're having a tough time, aren't you? Because I know there's, I, I know there's eel in there. You got the nature boy on your chest, and you're having a difficult time with this. Take the power of the nature boy, ingest it, and then swallow the daggum burger. Mm. Lando asked me this morning, he's like, who's that on your shirt? And I was like, he's a wrestler. And he was like, why does he look so calm? <laughs> and that's, that's what he got from this shirt, calm. He was a calm wrestler. He, I was like, he's, he's confident, man. And now I'm gonna be. Now, what we have done is we are not gonna just stop with recreating this, which if it's anywhere as nearly as good as this, I think it is worth standing mm -hmm. in the line. But we're gonna take it up a notch. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we're, not, we're not Emerald. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. I'll never say take, up a, take it up a notch when it comes to food again. You just said it twice, though. Okay, sorry. He says kick it up a notch. But I right, didn't say that. Right, we're gonna kick it up a notch. <laughs> yeah, that's what um, we're gonna do. Ladies and gentlemen, we have developed the Happy Eel Meal because uh, every kid loves an eel burger, every kid loves a Happy Meal, so we made a Happy Meal with other things that kids love. Um, there is a, oh my goodness. So there's the eel burger mm -hmm. in an aquarium, if you didn't notice. I think we call that a fishbowl, but with, it's fine. With fries. Oh my goodness. Sardine fries. We got the big ones. What on the? <laughs> it's like home fries, home sardines. I can still see the eyeball, guys. Yeah. Well, that's where you, how you know where to bite. Oh gosh. And then uh, down deep in here, we've got a whoa! Look at that. By the magic of editing, or not? Hold this. No, that's not gonna happen. Um, there is a milkshake. Ginger and wasabi. Mm. Juice G ginger and wasabi powder in this thing. What color is this? Let's take a and vanilla ice cream. I mean, it, it, still, it still just looks like cookies and cream ice cream, which uh, I'm sure it won't taste like it. And of course, every Happy Meal has got to have a toy. And since we figure that the kids are not going to really enjoy uh, the eel burger and the parents are going to eat it, we just put in a nose hair trimmer. Uh, <laughs> because, I mean, golly, do we need these these days. Nothing, I can't tell you. Nothing makes hair grow out of your nose I've been more than kids. It, I've been sticking it in my ears lately. Oh, I've done that too. I mean, what, what is happening to us? I got, I got. I don't know, man. There's just hair everywhere. <laughs> All right, so. You want me to do the, why don't you enjoy the milkshake for a moment and I'll, I'll. <laughs> oh, that tickles. <laughs> I've, I've been, hey, don't flinch. The nature boy wouldn't flinch, man. <laughs> I've, been, I've been needing hey, this. Stay just as calm as the nature boy this time, okay? <laughs> yeah, that, <laughs> you got some work to do. <laughs> Ric Flair would not be proud. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Right I, don't, I don't like this. <laughs> All right. But I do like this. I'm going to take a, uh, a sardine fry, and why don't you... Yeah, I got a lot of nose hair. That's what you're hearing. Why don't well, you wait until you go up in my grass? Come on. <laughs> Get up in them weeds. Hold on, but I want you to do it while I'm eating the sardine. I don't even have a Ric Flair shirt on. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I think I got oh. my stash. Oh, gosh. Oh, man. I got bone. There's a lot of bone. I mean, oh. is there ketchup to dip this thing in? No, there isn't. That is the worst. You guys, oh. I take everything back that I said. <laughs> I just realized that you shouldn't bite the squishy head of it. Oh. Okay, oh. well, anyway, 
Uh, wait in line at Shake Shack. We think it's worth it. Uh, and Shake Shack, if you're watching, uh, don't add the fries in the milkshake. <laughs> Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. You know what time it is. I'm Colleen from Manhattan in New York City, and it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. Thank you for going to savetheinternet.com to take action for net neutrality. Yes, savetheinternet.com, and click through to Good Mythical More, where we are going to highlight some ridiculous fast food lawsuits. Uh, while Rhett enjoys this milkshake, because you didn't try this yet. I didn't. I will. Lonely hashtag. Uh, this is when we find a very lonely hashtag on Instagram and then we add to it. This one is hashtag shoe water. Shoe water. Post your photo that makes sense with hashtag shoe water so it's not lonely anymore. Thanks for clicking subscribe. Click on the left to watch the show after the show, Good Mythical More. Click on the right to watch another episode of Good Mythical Morning. And be sure to check out our other channel, This Is Mythical, by clicking the video on the bottom. Thanks for being your mythical best.